Hi, and welcome to Live Webinar's Whiteboard Tutorial. The Whiteboard feature is great for visualizing concepts, teaching, and more. It's especially helpful for group work and collaboration, as anyone with the presenter role can draw on the board. To enable Whiteboard, simply click the plus icon or open share menu and select the Whiteboard. The Whiteboard has multiple functionalities. We'll explain them in order. First is the workspace. This is the place where you can draw on the whiteboard or on a file. We'll explain how to draw on a file in a moment. To add a new page, click here. And to check available pages, click here. First are cursor options. You can enable the cursor and choose what style it will have. We'll explain more about cursor options in a moment. Next is the Drawing Tools menu, which lets you choose between different kinds of tools for drawing, creating shapes, adding text, and more. You can also pick a stroke or fill color, customize the thickness of the line you're drawing with, and adjust font size. Use the eraser to remove certain lines or shapes, or click Clear All to erase all the drawings you've made so far. You can also use this option to undo or redo your last action. You can also download or export the file that you're currently working on by selecting this option. To add a grid pattern to the work page, click here. Now we'll come back to cursor options. There are three different cursor styles to choose from. When enabled, this style makes the nickname or email of the person who's presenting on the whiteboard visible next to the cursor. The next style, Enable Trail, shows the movement of the cursor to the attendees, while the Enabled Click Zone option makes the cursor bigger so the attendees can see where the presenter is clicking. Finally, you can enable the Click Sound feature to turn on a click sound for attendees. You can also upload a picture or file to draw on. To do so, Make sure that you've uploaded the desired image to your live webinar storage. Once that's done, enter your live webinar room and open the share menu. Select the storage option, find your image in the library and click present. Once it's opened, on the bottom of the content window, you'll find an option to enable the whiteboard. Select the option and you're ready to draw directly on your file. Remember that if you want your team to be able to work together on the whiteboard, all they need is to have the presenter role assigned, and you're ready for your teamwork to take off. Thank you for watching, and be sure to subscribe to our social media channels to stay up to date on all things live webinar.